Nehemiah chapter 12. And these were the priests and the Levites who came up with Zerubbabel, son of Sha'altiel, and Yeshua, Sarayah, Yermiah, Ezra, Amariah, Maluk, Hatush, Shekaniah, Rehum, Meramoth, Edo, Ginethoi, Abiyah, Miyamin, Ma'adiah, Bigla, Shemaiah, and Yoyarib, Yediah, Salu, Amok, Hilkiah, and Yediah. These were the heads of the priests and their brothers in the days of Yeshua. In the Levites, Yeshua, Benui, Kadmiel, Sherebiah, Yehuda, Matania, over the thanksgiving, he and his brothers in Bakbukiah and Uni, their brothers, were opposite them for guard duties. And Yeshua brought forth Yoyakim, and Yoyakim brought forth Eliashib, and Eliashib brought forth Yoyada, and Yoyada brought forth Jonathan, and Jonathan brought forth Yadua. And in the days of Yoyakim, the priests, the heads of the fathers' houses were Seriah, Meriah, of Yermiah, Hananiah, of Ezra, Meshulam, of Amariah, Yeho Hanan, of Meliku, Yohanan, of Shabaniah, Yosef, of Herin, Adna, of Merayoth, Helkai, of Edo, Zakariah, of Ginnathon, Meshulam, of Abiyah, Zikri, son of Minyamin, of Yoadia, Pilate, of Bigla, Shemua, of Shemaya, Yehonathan, of Yoyarib, Matanai, of Yedaya, Uzi, of Saleh, Kale, of Amok, Eber, of Hilkiah, and of Yedaya, Nathanel, the Lewites and priests in the days of Eliashib, Yoyada, Yohanan, and Yadua were recorded heads of their fathers' houses. Also the priests in the reign of Darayawesh, the Persian, the sons of Lewi, the heads of the fathers' houses, until the days of Yohanan, son of Eliashib, were written in the book of the Annals. In the heads of the Lewites were Hashabiah, Sherebiah, and Yeshua, son of Kadmiel, with their brothers opposite them to praise, to give thanks. Watch opposite watch, according to the command of Dawid, the man of Elohim, Matania, and Bakbukiah, Obadiah, Meshulam, Talmon, Akub, were gatekeepers guarding the storerooms of the gates. These were in the days of Yoyakim, son of Yeshua, son of Yosadak, and in the days of Nehemiah the governor, and of Ezra the priest, the scribe. And at the dedication of the wall of Yerushalayim, they sought out the Levites in all their places to bring them to Yerushalayim, to perform the dedication with gladness and with thanksgivings, and with singing, cymbals, harps, and lyres. And the sons of the singers gathered together from the countryside around Yerushalayim, from the villages of the Netophathites, and from the house of Gilgal, and from the fields of Geba and Asmaweth. For the singers had built themselves villages all around Yerushalayim, and the priests and Levites cleansed themselves, and they cleansed the people in the gates and the wall. And I brought the rulers of Yehuda up on the wall and appointed two large thanksgiving choirs to go to the right on the wall toward the dung gate. And after them went Hoshiah and half of the rulers of Yehuda, then Azariah, Ezra, and Meshulam, Yehuda, and Benjamin, and Shemaiah, and Yermiah, and of the sons of the priests with trumpets, Zechariah, son of Jonathan, son of Shemaiah, son of Matania, son of Micaiah, 
son of Zakur, son of Asaph, and his brothers Shemaiah, and Arzarel, and Milale, Gilale, Maye, Nathanel, and Yehuda, Hanani, with instruments of songs of Dawid, the man of Elohim, with Ezra the scribe before them. And at the fountain gate, and straight ahead of them, they went up the stairs of the city of Dawid on the stairway of the wall, beyond the house of Dawid, as far as the water gate eastward. And the other thanksgiving choir went over against them, and I behind them with half of the people on the wall, going past the tower of the ovens as far as the broad wall, and above the gate of Ephraim, and above the old gate, and above the fish gate, and the tower of Hananel, and the tower of the hundred as far as the sheep gate. And they stood still at the gate of the prison. Then the two thanksgiving choirs took their stand in the house of Elohim, and I and half of the deputy rulers with me, and the priest Eliakim, Maaseiah, Minyamin, Mikayah, Elio and Ne, Zakariah, and Hananiah with trumpets, and Maaseiah, and Shemaiah, and Eleazar, and Uzi, and Yehohanan, and Malkiah, and Elam, and Ezer. And the singer sang aloud with Yezebrayah in charge. And on that day they slaughtered great slaughterings and rejoiced, for Elohim had made them rejoice with great joy. And the women and the children also rejoiced, so that the joy of Yahushalayim was heard far away. And on that day some were appointed over the rooms for the stores, for the contributions, for the first fruits, and for the tithes, to gather into them from the fields of the cities, the portions required by the Torah, for the priests and for the Levites. For Yehuda rejoiced over the priests and the Levites who stood up. Both the singers and the gatekeepers guarded the charge of their Elohim and the charge of the cleansing, according to the command of Dawid and Shlomo his son. For in the days of Dawid and Asaf of old, there were chiefs of the singers and songs of praise and thanksgiving to Elohim. And in the days of Zerubbabel, and in the days of Nehemiah, all Israel gave the portions for the singers and the gatekeepers, a portion for each day. And they set apart what was for the Lewites, and the Lewites set apart what was for the children of Aharon.